What's up guys? Uh, we are diving back in to another episode of Assassin's Creed Odyssey. Yes, I know that was that was bad, but uh, we're back boys. I'm excited to be back and uh, Herotidos. What's up, brother? They're not ones for subtlety, are they? We have uh, we've got the mask, we've got the robe, we've got everything we need. So, this is it. Hidden chamber of the cultists. Here. All along. I'm going inside. Keep my clothes for me. Best not to go in with your weapons, either. I don't think they'll look too kindly on that. Okay, dude, this is creepy. How do I look? <laughs> <laughs> Terrifying. Good. Find me once you've found out the truth in there. Keep your wits about you. Try not to do anything rash. Me, Rash. He looks ridiculous, dude. If this isn't the spookiest thing we've done all day. Who thought these ridiculous costumes were a good idea? We're going undercover of a major cult. Is there anything over there we can pick up? There is. It's tiny amounts of drag me though. Probably best not to blow our cover. Oh, look at that snake, dude. What the heck? Be careful of the snakes in the grass. You're late, very late. It's a good thing Vimos hasn't arrived yet. Sorry, it's my uh, first time. A new recruit? <gasps> welcome, welcome! You mentioned someone. Vimos. Who is that? You'll learn her name very, very quickly. She's our leader. I'm sure she believes that, but no. She's our weapon. She's difficult, but she does important work for us. I don't envy her position one bit. I'll go talk to the others. Thank you. Yes, yes, before Demos comes. Who knows if you'll get a word in after that. Demos, huh? Alright, so we've got to talk to the other cult members and find out what their plans are. Now, I've noticed that they're, uh, each of the masks are unique. And, uh, they all have different features on them, so I'm hoping nobody recognizes us. I mean, we can't blow our cover. We gotta do it. We just have to keep our sights on what the bloodline will do for us. The bloodline? The mother, the father, the brother. You know, her kin. We need them. All of them. To use them? That information is not for Vimos, of course. You know how volatile she is. She could rip through us easily. I'll be sure to keep it to myself. As you should. Nor can she know we're about to capture her mother. <laughs> Tell me about Demos. She's shown us what we need to know. She's a machine, a weapon for the cult. Someone that unstable can't be trusted with such personal information. I have to go. To our great ambition. To ambition. I'll need much more information to identify hmm. who this cult is star. You are not listening. I'm still not convinced. You. We need another opinion on this. Why split resources searching for a woman we can't find? If we narrow our focus, Athens will be ours. Immediate threats have to be destroyed. Pericles has to be destroyed. Not without the mother. We aren't strong enough without the mother. Don't let Vimos hear that. If 
anything, we should be hunting the father. Dude, I'm so lost. know who the mother is. Looking for the father would be a waste of resources. What do you think? Hunt the champion's mother or her father? I've heard everybody else talking about the mother, so we're gonna go with that. He's right. Get your priority straight. Before you know it, Pericles will shore up his defenses and we will have lost our chance. No, if you'll excuse me. I hear you perfectly well. You're just wrong. You need to look for the father now. It's gonna let us talk to her directly. The cult must decide. Or not. I'd like to know what's going on with this pyramid thing. That's kind of interesting. It's in the loading screen of the game. Hmm. I don't see that there's anybody else we can talk to. Look at this guy's sight, dude. Some people in here have weapons. We probably could have brought our weapons. Maybe we don't talk to anybody else. Maybe we... Go exploring. Why face, so sad, like the tragic mask of Melpomene. Your family is safe for now. Just, just don't touch them. Don't hurt them. That is up to you, but I know you behave because you know their fates if you don't. Please, don't. We will kill them. Your wife, your child, and then what would you have to live with? Nothing. Exactly. A little bit of eavesdropping, all right. Looks like we've got another secret room beyond this waterfall. Letters to and from the cult. Gods, they have a foothold in every part of the Greek world. We're in more danger than I thought. Hmm. We've got one more piece that we need. Where's it gonna be? Must be over here. Nobody's noticing this guy that's randomly walking up by himself, snooping around, picking things up, creeping in doorways. Oh Lord. Is this Demos? yourself together, Malaka. You're a fucking pig before slaughter. I'll do it. I swear. I'll kill him. No. Let me go. You like to watch, you sick fuck. You're not just going to watch. You're going to teach this little insolent shit a lesson. I don't think I want to. Does it fucking matter, does it? What I say goes. No questions asked. I... I couldn't do it. But I'm not scared. Not anymore. If you can't kill a fucking Archon, what are you gonna do when I tell you to kill a fucking Archon? I will. I will. I'll kill Fidias. I... Show him what happens to cowards. They get fucking burned. No, he's yours. <laughs> you don't know what the fuck fun is. <laughs> More for me. I don't want to do. <sighs> fuck with me, and there's plenty more where that came from. I didn't want to be the one to do it. I also didn't want to blow our cover, though. So we couldn't couldn't just like flat out say no. I don't do it. Feel something. Towards the, the pyramid, it's covered in shards, like albinos. Uh -oh. Place the fragment on the artifact. So we got that little triangular piece of Alpinor's body. 
in the last episode when we took him out. And it looks like we might be able to activate this somehow. It's got a missing piece right there. I'm still so lost, dude. Obviously, we know this is bad news, but... Ah, you had the last piece. Now it is ready. Every time I see it, it calls to me and sings of power. Does it call to you like it calls to me? It does. What are you doing? Have you lost your mind? No. She hasn't even arrived yet. Gather yourself and hold your tongue, fool. Show respect for the bloodline. Whatever the heck that means. Wait, what? No way. It's our sister. El Pinor is dead. One of you is a traitor. The artifact will expose them. You! Everyone will be tested. Dude, no way. You first. Go. Oh, dude, we're so screwed. That's not us, though. Go. She's gonna pick us out. I know it. No, not me. Oh, God, dude. <gasps> She's gonna know it's us. It's showing the visions that it's us. She's gonna see that we try to save her. Did like somebody else was Cassandra is Demo. She's the leader of the cult, and the cult is trying to make an uprising against her. They're trying to go after her mother, which is 
our mother and we told them to go after our mother. Dude, this is, I still don't understand what the, like the cult's trying to like take over the world or something, obviously. I don't know what their entire plan is or what they're here for, or what they want the power for. But she's the current leader of it, our sister. And she, she deliberately chose not to kill us. So obviously she knows something weird. Dude, this is, this is weird. There's Herotodos. Oh, you're alive. Shit just got real, bro. It's not good. There were people in the temple. I couldn't see their faces. They... Herotodos. They control all of the Greek world. Everything. I see. It's worse than I thought. There's more. They have a weapon. What kind? A soldier. Stronger and more ferocious than any I've ever seen. Herodotus. It's my sister. We need to get to Athens. Athens? We need to find my mother. My clothes. Spear. Uh, of course. My spear. So somehow both of these kids fell off that, that cliff when they were young, survived, and grew up to become legendary warriors. The cult of Cosmos called my sister, Vimos. She used an artifact to see my memories. Alexios, the man I serve, we must tell him what's happened before it's too late. You've heard the name Pericles before. Oh yeah. Pericles is the great general leading the Delian League against the Spartans. They say he's ruthless. We aren't leading the League against anyone. Pericles is a man of peace. This war was thrust upon him. Upon us all. A general who doesn't want war? Not likely. Save your doubts. He is working to end this war. We all are. If there are forces colluding against him, he must be warned. We have to go. To Athens? They're hunting my family. My mother! I have to find her. You carry the blade of Leonidas. Act like it. If Pericles doesn't put an end to this war, we're all as good as dead. Including your mother. Fuck your war! The cultists are exterminating my family! You have a duty to the Greek world. We both do. Pericles must be warned. I'm on her road to Dose's side. She is my mother. What would you have me do? If there is one place where we can find information about your mother, it is in Athens. How? Pericles surrounds himself with the brightest minds in Athens. Which is to say anywhere. In Athens, you can fulfill your duty to your family. Hmm. But before we can go, I need you to meet me at the Lion of Leonidas, at Thermobile. Leonidas? Why? There's something I need to know. Something that may help us take down this cult and save your mother. You've proven I can trust you. But let's make it quick, Herodotus. First to Romopoli, then we go to Athens. Well, he wasn't too hard to convince. I agree that we need to go take care of this war and save I'll humankind. Sure every single one of these cultists dies by my hands. Before, uh... Before we worry about our mother directly. Alright, the Cult of the Cosmos is a secret organization of powerful people plotting to control the world. Seek clues across Greece to unveil the identity of all members of the cult and put an end to it once and for all. So we now have a new cultists menu. Interesting.
Unveil, track, and eliminate are our goals. So we got Elpinor. Solterra is in her warehouse in Megaris. Owns a slave operation in Attica. Midas the banker in Argos. We took down uh, this guy. He was already in there. All right. So you have to you have to find clues on the cultists, but if they're white, if they're covered in white, that means they're ready to unveil. So if we unveil her, Cosmos demands to know the secrets hiding in the hearts of men. So I simply cut them open. Okay, so if we track her, if we go over to our map, here's where she is. We can fast travel over there and maybe take her out. I don't know. Let's let's try to take our first cultist out. I think that's a good a good spot to start. So there's dude, this is crazy. I remember in, in uh Origins we had what was it like you know five or seven different things we had to take out. This is like 15 people that we're gonna have to take out over time. Now the, the good part is is it seems fairly simple. You go, you find clues, you pick them out. There's not like a whole bunch of missions going on, but I don't know. So here we go. This is our first cultist over here. She's just 250 meters away. I'm not really sure what to expect once we get there, but we're, dude, we're just gonna charge right in there. She's in a fort that we're not allowed in. She's actually on the complete backside. We might be able to go around and just swim to her. So I guess my biggest question is, is she just gonna be a simple, a simple assassination? She's not gonna be like a big mega boss or anything. Confirm cultist kill. Well, this is gonna be a problem. Gonna have to take these guys out. Didn't sign up for this. Got him. Whew, that was nasty. Confirm the kill. Well, I enjoyed that. Not bad. We just found a new mercenary. Do we do we get much objective or, or much objective? Do we get much uh, XP for taking her out? I don't know. How tough can you really be, bro? He's pretty tough. All right, I'm gonna get out of here. Okay, so that's that's basically what we have to do. We've gotta gotta run around. We've gotta kill the cultists. Gotta. Take them all out one by one. And if we can do that, then that's how we're gonna win Greece back. I like it, dude. This is pretty cool. At least we kind of have an idea of what we're doing. We're starting to get a, a little bit better hold of what's going on. Another one we have here, we can go ahead and unveil. Democracy when Thrakmi rules the world? So we can track this. Looks like we don't get XP for taking them out, which is kind of unfortunate. Um. This dude's all the way down here. All right, interesting. So yeah, we just, we, we kind of want to go through and we just want to want to end up unveiling everybody that we possibly can. Looks like each What's person gives you some sort of a, uh, behind it. some sort of a, a wearable as well as their little triangle piece. Slaves understand you better when you carve your rules into the backs of their heads. <laughs> okay. The cult is nothing without me. Even the gods cower in my wake. Kneel or die. I really hope we're not gonna have Chaos to kill her, dude. Is our greatest strength. Belos the beast of Sparta. Yeah, I don't want to mess with him. He looks pretty tough. Not gonna lie. The fight is only over when I am the last man left standing. This is this is pretty sick, dude. I like this. I like the fact that we're gonna have to gather clues from all over the place. Only to realize the cult was my home. Asterion. Is that not the... 
Is that not the name of our ship? Isn't our ship called the Asterion? Hold on, where's it out on the map? Adrestia. I was gonna say, dude, holy cow. But uh, anyway, yeah. Alright, well, there you guys have it. The cult has been unveiled to an extent. Obviously, I have a lot of work to go, but uh, we're off to a good start. Alright, guys, so moving on to our next thing, going to meet with Herotodos. He wanted to meet at those springs or whatever they were. I don't know the actual name. Uh, they're way below us. We have to climb this mountain just to get down into these hot springs. So this should be this should be kind of interesting. We're gonna go do this and then I think he said we're going to Athens next, so it's just cra it's crazy how big this map is, dude. If you take a look at it, we are just barely scratching the surface. Look at all this. We've just gotten started. This game is enormous. I mean all Assassin's Creed games are, but I feel like this one's especially so. So yeah, we're 388 meters away, but it kind of feels like we're on top of it because we're literally on top of a mountain. We're going to make our way down there. I don't even know if these are actual hot springs that we're trying to go to. It said something about thermo something. I don't know. I just envisioned it as hot springs. I doubt that's actually what's happening here, but we're just, we're going to keep on, keep on keeping on, boys. Gotta try to do this without falling to our untimely death. Come on, let me know. There we go. The cave of Kratos. Wait, what? Kratos is in here? What's up, fam? Boy. Y'all think there's a way we could take a little dive off this rock into that water? All my life I've heard stories of Leonidas. I can't believe I'm finally seeing where history was made. We can! And this is a hot spring. I called it, baby. Thermopoly. They say you can't walk this battlefield without getting blood on your toes. Why is that highlighted? Oh, it's highlighted because the bird was coming to get him. Nice, good job. What's up, brother? If you close your eyes, you can hear them. Their final war cries before every last one of those brave Spartans perished. Their voices were silenced that day, but their story will be sung for an eternity. You didn't bring me here to talk about dead Spartans. What's on your mind, Herothos? The Battle of Thermopylae still echoes in our hearts. But to stand here is to feel it in your bones. There is nothing here but ghosts. My concerns are with the living. Hold out your spear. My spear? What for? I need to know something. He's up to something.
Oh, he got him back. And that's the death of Leonidas. And that's the spear. Herodotos. Uh. I'm fine. I'm fine. The stories are true. That is the spear of Leonidas. The hero's blade. You knew this would happen. I didn't know, but I did suspect. There is a place I convinced myself was a dream. Until now. A peculiar structure on the island of Andros. Mysterious shapes carved in stone. Like nothing I've ever seen. You want to sail to Andros so you can show me shapes? <laughs> in my travels, I heard whispers of an ancient civilization. A people who came before. Your spear and that place are connected. Well, let's loose the sails and head that way. I trust you. You understand? I will do everything in my power to help you find your mother. I promise. But first, we must sail to the island of Andros. I'll meet you at my ship. Alright guys, I think that's a good spot to stop this episode, so hope you guys enjoyed. We're going to embark on this sea journey in the next one, and uh, I'm going to see you guys later. Peace out.